Hi everybody, this is the Baseball Hut, the amazing, spectacular, terrific, the great one, the People's Champion, your host, the Hut. And breaking news here at the Hut, uh, Carlos Correa has finally decided to sign with a team. He has signed with the Minnesota Twins on a six-year, I guess, $200 million contract. So he is he is going to Minnesota. Now, if you're a Mets fan that's very upset about that, I, I'm, I'm pissed off too because this has gone on for three weeks and I think we're all very angry at the player. I'm not angry at ownership. I'm not angry at Steve Cohen. Uh, this is disappointing for a lot of people. Uh, now, the Mets are going to have to figure out where to go from here. They'll probably hold on to Ed Eduardo Escobar. But this is a, a stunner uh, that he was going back to Minnesota. Well, he's not going to win in Minnesota. So for all this nonsense that we've been dealing with over the last couple of weeks, where uh, the player was going to go to, he was going to go to the Mets. He wore a shirt. I want to point something out. I was looking at something. I was looking at Baseball Reference earlier. Uh, Carlos Baerga, who had put out that the Mets were going to sign uh, Correa last night. A little news here. Well, it's not news. It's just I just looked it up. He is a former client of Scott Boris. So Scott Boris was the source for this deal that he supposedly said the Mets were going to get. So so Carlos Baerga has zero, and the hut means zero credibility when it comes to anything that is related to the Boris camp. Now, his credibility is garbage. But as you can tell, even from my voice, I'm very angry that this player, because this player dragged his feet for three weeks, not... He wanted to be a Met. That's all we were hearing. That he, oh, he was going to be a Met. Well, you know what? Go back to the Minnesota Twins. The Twins are going to be bad. They were bad last year with him, and they're going to be bad again this year. The Mets are a team on the rise. They're going to stay there. They got a chance to win more than just one World Series with this group, with this ownership group running it. So I want to thank you all for coming by. I will have more when I get back to the hut. We'll do a live stream later and discuss this whole thing. So thank you. Please subscribe to the Baseball Hut, and I'll see you later.